Here's a question asked on one of the web work problems. Consider the problem of finding the angles between 0 and 2 pi so that the cosine is equal to 1 half. Now we're going to look at this solution in two different ways. First of all, let's think of, of what it means for the cosine of the angle to be equal to 1 half. The cosine is the adjacent over the hypotenuse. So here's an example triangle that might might happen, and I'm thinking of this angle right here as being theta. So a little bit of Pythagorean theorem tells me that this is going to be the square root of 3. Now that's a triangle that we know a lot about. That's a special angle that we already know. That angle happens to be 60 degrees or pi over 3. Okay, That's just because we know that particular triangle. That's one of our special angles. Theta is equal to pi over 3 or it's equal to 60 degrees, whichever one you're looking at. Now, I didn't organize too well here because what you need to see is that over here, the cosine would also be one half. So picking a negative theta or picking a two pi minus theta, either one of those would work. So, so there are some other solutions here. Notice that we need to have a solution between 0 and 2 pi, so the negative uh, 60 degrees isn't going to do the job, but, but we get these other, these other solutions where this is equal to 2 pi minus pi over 3, if we're doing it in, in radians. So if we went all the way around and then backed up so that we get this, this lighter uh, green triangle, then we'd have that amount. Now you get a common denominator here. I guess that would be 3, so this would be 6 pi over 3 minus pi over 3, and that's going to be a 5 pi over 3. Okay, of course there's lots of other solutions now. Any of the, those two solutions plus a 2 pi will get you back to those those uh, two places. Now let's look at this in a in another view. Here I've drawn the graph of uh, the cosine and notice that this axis is going to be the theta axis. This amount is 1 and this down here is at, at a minus 1. It's an even function. So the the thing that we're looking for is some place where the angle so that this cosine is equal to one half and that's right here let me change colors that's right here which is at pi over three that's what we already noticed and notice because this is an even function then over here there's also going to be an answer of, of at a negative pi over three it's all if I put a negative pi over three in there, I'm also going to get going to get one half. But the idea is that there's lots of other places that I'm going to get one half. That's over here. So that's our two pi minus pi over three. That's our five pi over three is is up here. Five pi over three is another solution. Okay, so we're we're we can see these two solutions either by looking just at the triangles and how they f and how they wrap around or we can look at the graph of this thing and discover um, the results okay i hope that helps a little bit